Top of the fourth, Rangers with a 1 0 lead over the Athletics, and we're pleased to be joined in the booth by the general manager, Billy Bean. Billy, thanks for stopping by. Okay. Busy day. Ray. Good to see you, Billy. As well. All right, so let's get right to it. Bob Melvin, three year extension. How long has have you guys been working on this? And you know, we, we talked about it earlier, and we said, great guy, great manager, and we're pretty thrilled. I'm sure you are too. Yeah, we've, uh, you know, it's been probably been talking about the last month. Uh, and uh, we had some procedures we had to go through and uh, you know from my end Bob's been fantastic. He said he took over in a very challenging time for us in the middle of the season. He didn't know anybody. He didn't know the staff uh, really the only guy he knew knew was really me and uh, and I think between myself David Farhan in front office uh, you know, our training staff uh, uh, we couldn't be happier with the job he's done and you know, listen under very challenging circumstances he inherited you know like Bob had he had a number of injuries when he first came over. Uh, so uh, but uh, we are very pleased to know that he's going to be here for at least the next three years. What did you see in him and, and of course the interim tag was there but uh, I thought you brought up a great point and Bob as well during the press conference about the evaluation process you had a chance to actually see him and of course Bob with this ball club what, what did you see that impressed you the most or what have you seen. You know Bob's got great communication skills and you know I know that's a sort of a buzzword <laughs> that you, you hear all the time but he I truly see it with him he's mm -hmm. got a real awareness of what's going on in his clubhouse. He uh, in great communication with the front office great with Lou you know mm -hmm. listen uh, there's a lot of people you have to communicate in this organization and in all organizations. And uh, uh, it, it was really it was evident uh, from the beginning that not only was he a, uh, a players manager but he was also a uh, organizations manager. And that he found a way to uh, really, uh, you know, convey his, his <laughs> thoughts clearly, and 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 he does address things too. We, when things happen, he gets on them, and he's very, very passionate. That's one thing that really surprised me. I mean, there's, if you know Bob, uh, he seems to have a laid-back personality, but that's not the case. <laughs> and I mean, in a good way. I mean, this guy is in there uh, like clockwork at 11:30 uh, every single day for a night game. He's got a routine down, and by the time we come down for lunch, he's he's got an hour's work in. <laughs> Couple of quick outs for Brandon McCarthy as he faces Beltre. But you know, it, it, it's it's got to be better to sit and watch a guy like Ray said manage for two three months as opposed to sitting in an interview room and, and asking him questions. And where you may be thinking, oh, is this guy saying what I want to hear? Is he being honest? Right? I'm sure you've had that situation before. Yeah, you do, and you know, and uh, when you've got you know a couple months to sit with a guy every day, yeah. see him in, in good times and in bad times, that's really a better, uh, that's a better interview process than sitting down with somebody for an hour. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, so uh, and then and once again, Bob too. I mean, you know, Bob had to come over here. I think he's a really highly regarded guy in this game, and and uh, I think he had to get to know us, feel comfortable here, mm -hmm. and uh, and then that happened right from the start. He's from the area, so he's, we certainly had a little bit of an edge. <laughs> uh, and uh, he seems to be really happy. Once again, I couldn't be happier the fact that he's going to be here for the next couple of years. You know, it says a lot about him, and, and maybe you could comment on the fact that whenever one of the somebody in the press conference says, "What do you think about next year?" I said, I "said I'm thinking about tonight against the Rangers and the rest of the season." I mean, that had to mean a lot to you as a general manager because you know he's going to be thinking more about just the next three years. He's thinking about the present. Yeah, you know, and I followed up with the same answer mm -hmm. because he gave the perfect one. I didn't right. think I can improve upon it. <laughs> uh, you know, there, there's listen every game in uh, Major League Baseball. There's value in winning every single right. game, and uh, I like that attitude. And you know, we've got a week to go in the season, yeah. but you know what? Uh, we're going to try and win every one of them, and it starts with the manager, and he's got a great attitude in that regard. Chop towards Sizemore. He's got it, and we'll continue our conversation with the general manager, Billy Bean.